The book I chose for this activity is called The Colors of Us. It's by Karen Katz. The reason I chose this book is because I thought this could be really beneficial in our classrooms as teachers. The book is about um, different cultures and it kind of explains how people look different. I think uh, an activity that would be great for students and teachers to use in the classroom would be to read this book and then they could do a group activity and maybe go around and talk about um, where they're from. Reading this book will be really good for students because they'll get to go around the classroom and learn about where their peers are like, what culture they are, and just some really like maybe fun facts or details about their lives that they didn't know before. And I think that'll make students realize that not everybody is the same, but that is perfectly okay. So now I'm going to read the book. So it's called The Colors of Us by Karen Katz. My name is Lena and I am seven. I am the color of cinnamon. My mom says she could eat me up. My mom's the color of French toast. She's an artist. Mom's teaching me how to mix colors. She says that if I mix red, yellow, black, and white paints in the right combination, I will have the right brown for a picture of me. The right brown? But mom, brown is brown, I say. That's not so, mom says. But there's a lot of different shades of brown. Let's take a walk and you'll see. We go to the playground where we see my friend, Sony. Sony is a light yellow brown, mom says. Just like creamy peanut butter, I say. My favorite. Isabel is chocolate brown, like the cupcakes we had for her birthday. Lucy has skin that's peachy and tan. My best friend, Jojen, lives close to the playground. Jojen is the color of honey. Two streets over, we meet my cousin Kyle. His skin is a reddish brown, like the leaves in fall. Carlos and Rosita have, <coughs> have brought in their new puppy to the park. Carlos is a light cocoa brown, and Rosita's skin looks like butterscotch. When we pass by the pizza par parlor, Mom and I see Mr. Pellegrino flipping a pizza high in the air. He's the color of pizza crust, a golden brown. My babysitter Candy looks like a beautiful jewel, bronze and amber. She looks like a princess. Mom and I walk to the park to eat our lunch. Look at everyone's legs. Mom, all the different shades. After lunch, we walk to Mom's favorite store, where Mr. Cashmere sells many different spices. He's the color of ginger and chili powder. Up the street is my Aunt Kathy's laundromat. Aunt Kathy is tawny, like coconuts and coffee toffee. After our walk, my friends come over. We take our towels to the roof and lie in the sun. I think about everyone I saw today. Sony, Isabel and Lucy, Jojen and Kyle, Carlos and Rosita, Mr. Pellegrino and Candy, Mr. Cashmere and Aunt Kathy, each one of them a beautiful color. My friends leave and I go downstairs. I am happy as I get out my paints, yellow, red, black, and white. I think about all the wonderful colors I will make and I will say their names out loud. Cinnamon, chocolate, and honey. Coffee, toffee, and butterscotch. They sound so delicious. At last, my pictures are done, and I've painted everyone. Look, Mom, I say, the colors of us.